Okay, so in this tutorial, which I'm pretty sure is the last tutorial, I'm going to be going over the ruler tool. So, as you can see up here, you put the ruler. So when you drag it out onto your work plane, it makes sort of it makes an L, and when you let go, it pops up with these. So what this means is when you drag out the shape, it pops up with all the dimensions. So if and it means you can get exact dimensions. So if I type in 40, it will be exactly 40 long. Now I don't see that much point in the ruler anymore because now if you click on this, you've basically got a ruler here. The only thing that you've got with the ruler is um you can exactly change how high off the ground so I can make it 40 and it's exactly 40 off the ground so that's actually basically it for the ruler I'll see you in the next video